Ghana launched a domestic debt exchange starting Monday to swap around 137 billion cities or $9.7 billion in current debt for four new bonds. The finance minister assured the move aimed to restore macroeconomic stability. The local currency has lost 50% in value this year, helping to push up debt. Today's announcement is a major policy step that the government is taking over the short period to restore macroeconomic stability, achieve debt sustainability, and get the economy fully back on track in order to create and protect jobs, provide and enhance incomes, foster strong and inclusive growth led by exports, and restore hope to the Ghanaian people. Coupled with an upcoming IMF deal, the debt operation is expected to bring inflation back to single digits. The minister added the swap impact on investors holding government bonds would be minimized. This is a key requirement to allow Ghana's economy to recover as fast as possible from this crisis. This is also a key requirement to secure an IMF support. The alternative will be a far worse economic crisis with protracted closure from international markets, including imported goods and services, and further domestic e economic instability, both for the real economy and the financial sector. Under the domestic debt exchange, local bonds will be exchanged for new ones set to mature between 2027 and 2037.